Local 3 Sports with Tor Thorne. After notching a 5-0 win on Friday night, Michigan Tech Hockey welcomed in Bowling Green again tonight for the second in a best of three series in the first round of the CCHA playoffs. Let's head up to Houghton for the matchup between the Huskies and the Falcons. We're going to pick up with Bowling Green up 1-0 in the first. Spencer Kirsten comes flying in off the edge. The quick wrister gets through and it's 2-0 Falcons. But still, first period, Huskies attacking here. A nice pass across the ice finds Blaze Richards, who scores it between the legs of the goalie. It'd be 2-1 heading into the second. Then in the second period, there's going to be a fight for the puck along the boards here. But a heads up pass from Tyrone Bronte finds Isaac Gordon for the slap shot. We're tied at two. Another tech goal gives the Huskies a 3-2 lead, but still in the second period. It's going to be Brett Foe getting separation for Bowling Green. He sneaks it under the crossbar to tie the game up at three. Then a short while later, Falcons on the attack again. A deflection off the board gets to Ben Duran with a wide open shot. And the Falcons take back the lead four to three. But we're still in a crazy second period here. This time Michigan Tech. The shot deflected initially, but Bronte there to finish the job. And we're tied up at four. Now still in the second period for this next shot. The setup shot, gonna find Jack Works right next to the net, and that's another lead change. Tech leads five to four heading into the third. Then picking up early on in the third period, it's gonna be Foe again, all alone, gets it to go stick side. That's gonna tie the game up back up at five. Then moving ahead, nearing the end of the third period, Huskies on a power play, looking to close it out. They find Mosley wide open for the slap shot. And that's how this one would end. The Huskies hold on to win a thriller up in Houghton to advance by a score of six to five. I'm really proud of our group because there's games this year where we have not, you know, not been sharp and we don't find it. We don't find a way to win. And we found a way to get six goals and had one di disallowed that they had to look a long time at. So theoretically seven goals. So I'm extremely proud of our group. Anyway, anytime you can win an elimination game, it's really hard, and uh, again, this was a roller, co uh, roller coaster game with a lot of emotion on the bench um, in a lot of different areas. I could feel the tension in some ways, um, but I think it's a real, uh, it's a life lesson growing thing, I think, for, for the guys individually and collectively. And for NMU Hockey tonight on the road versus Minnesota State, they lose to the Mavericks by a score of 6-1. to one.